Hey, I'm Maggie Shea, and I'm here with Steph Robel, my skipper. Um, the two of us sail 49er FX for the U.S. sailing team, and we're really looking forward to representing you in Tokyo this summer. On our team, we think it's really important to have clear job roles on and off the water. Um, off the water, Maggie is in charge of all the boat work, and she does an absolutely incredible job of uh, managing everything and making sure everything is um, well kept um, so that we don't have any breakdowns on the water and when she's doing the boat work I'll be focusing more on logistics or um, fundraising kind of the um, behind the scenes work that needs to be done um, in order for us to go compete. Yeah raise more money. Today we want to tell you about a really cool piece of equipment that Harkin developed. Um, it's called the Harkin 9051 Adjustable Angle Swivel Cam Base, but for us it's the jib sheet cleat. <laughs> um, and we love it. We've been collaborating with Harkin since about 2018, working on this piece, and it's a really specifically designed, brilliantly engineered uh, piece of hardware that really enhances our performance and actually makes the boat easier to sail. So this is the original piece of equipment that we were looking to replace. Um, it's, we use it as our jib sheet and it swivels around the boat um, this way, but it will, it's not adjustable up and down in terms of the height of the cleat. So in light air, we want the jib cleat to be higher up because our trapeze gear is higher up. Um, so I can easily uncleat it and recleat it at a higher height. And then as it gets windier, I go down on the trapeze gear and need it at a lower angle for while I'm out on the wire, being able to uncleat and recleat at an easy angle. So that's really important. And then having um, a really smooth swivel back and forth is important for when we're changing tacks, but also when we're going fore and aft with our weight on the boat. Um, in light air, we'll go forward. In heavier air, we'll go back in the boat. And having it um, move along with us freely is really important. So in 2018, Steph and I were competing in Aarhus, Denmark at the World Championship and Harkin sent a group over to support us and the boat park. And um, Oakley Jones and Bill Foudy came and they, they walked through our whole boat and we showed them all the little bits and bobs that we could use and help us. And this was specifically something that we showed them and, and we explained, hey, right now we have to actually physically bend the cleat up and down in order to get the angle correct uh, for where we're sheeting from. And they, they went to work and over the course of a couple of years, we received a prototype. Um, this past winter uh, and we tried it out. We absolutely loved it. It's a pretty brilliant piece of engineering. Basically the height of this jib cleat is adjusted with an Allen key wrench and a small piece that um, slides. So there, you don't actually have to compromise the equipment to change the angle of sheeting. It's, um, it's designed to be changed and you can do it with tools and you don't have to just step on it or pull it up um, and risk breaking the equipment at a, at a critical moment. So this is the old piece that we've just taken off. And you can see that this um, platform here, like sort of the arm that the cleat sits on, is fixed in space. So we have to physically bend the metal to change the angle of sheeting. So whereas on the new Harkin piece, we can adjust the angle based on how we install it. So there is a range, a fore and aft range here, that we can choose from when we tighten these screws down. And you can see that based on where you tighten the screws, will change the angle of the cleat from all the way down to all the way up. The final step of installation is to decide how high we want this jib cleat to sit based on the conditions for the day. So as we tighten these screws, this platform can be in a number of positions, fore and aft, which will dictate the angle of the cleat. So these are simple screws that you use an Allen key and tighten. And this is a step that we can do every day in the boat park before we go racing. So where would you like your jib cleat, Miss Madam Skipper? Let's put it in light air position. Okay, you got it. All the way up. All the way up. <laughs> Was that too dorky? <laughs> How's that look? <laughs> Perfect. Beautiful. All right, good job, team. Yeah.